Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sagar Prajapati and in this video I will be talking about how to skip n number of lines while loading data using copy activity. So before going to this video, I would like to introduce my channel that is Geek Coders and here I upload videos on Azure Data Factory, Azure Data Bricks, SQL, Spark, Python and so on. If you are liking my videos, you can go and watch it out and subscribe to my channel and share with your friends so that everyone will get benefited so let's get started with today's video so today we have to skip unwanted records while copying data from source using copy activity in adf so let me open my csv file here you can see we have null null abcs and then we have proper header and we have some proper records so we have to load this record, these records with the headers into our sync location. But these records are like junk records or unwanted records which we do not want. And business is saying every time this file comes in the source location with these four unwanted records. Okay, maybe the metadata or anything else. Okay, comment something like that. But we are sure that we will have these four rows only and then we will have our correct data now we want to skip these four rows and we need to we need to copy this thing so how would we do that so let me open my get data factory and right now i have a blob i mean i have a link service of blob storage so let me go to author button and here I will create a data set. So let me write here blob. And here I will choose CSV, continue, choose link service. I can choose any one of it and go to OK. Now here I will go to parameter option and I will create two parameter like container. And here blob and if I go back to connection here I have to pass a dynamic content I will choose container parameter and here I will choose blob parameter that's done now if I go to my pipeline and click new pipeline if I open this copy data activity here you can see we have two options okay i will choose source choose my link service sorry data set and here i will pass source and blob name is testing underscore four dot csv same in the sync i will choose a data set and here i will pass sync and here i will pass testing underscore four dot csv that's done go back to source and if I go down then here you can see we have an option option of skip line count so we know that we need to skip four four records for this blob every time so I will pass it here four and that's done now what I will do I will do publish all and then i will do debug let me go to my blog and if i go to sync It is done. Let me open this testing to underscore four dot csv and if I click on add button, then you can see we have only ID name like the record start from my headers, which is fine. Okay. So I hope you have understood this video and the concept. So we have multiple multiple scenarios. We have it and we will moving forward. We will seeing 
that you know uh, what does this copy behavior means what which file level, like which copy behavior we have to choose and when and then we have in the source side also we have this filter by last modified date then we have enable partition discovery many things we have it okay so we will be seeing in the future videos so i hope you have liked if you like this video do share with your friends